Thank you. Thank you for having me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So you were saying earlier that you wanted to work on weight loss, but you had some memories you thought might be really key to that process. Yes. Yeah. Um, I was heavy as a child, and I remember a lot of comments from people. Right. One in particular was a, a time my grandmother, grandmother had come back to visit, and I was on uh, her bed with her, and we were snuggling, and she was telling me a story about this little girl who ate and ate and ate and outgrew all of her pretty clothes and wasn't that awful. And the family story goes that I just looked at her and said, no, I think that's pretty good. And that kind of tied into another memory which came up was... Um, just take a breath yeah. on saying that and uh, feel into your body. And often we just run through these things, so it's good to just pause and feel in to your, your core and see how you feel. So when you tell that story, what number are you in your body and where do you feel it? Um, I feel it in my uh, abdomen, and I'd say it's around a six. And if you had to give that movie a name, what would your name for the movie be? Outgrew Her Clothes. Outgrew Her Clothes. So say it again two or three more times. Say Outgrew Her Clothes. Outgrew Her Clothes. Outgrew Her Clothes. Outgrew Her Clothes. Are you slow six or are you? Uh, yeah, no, seven. <laughs> <laughs> look at your face, you look like you're more than a six, so. <laughs> yeah, so I just wanted to make sure you, and, and you can say, that, say that the name that will often bring out a lot of the feelings inherent in the, in the event. So, because okay, so Alpha Repose is the name of the event. And where do you feel that six? Uh, still in my stomach. Okay. Okay, so the other red that came to your mind? Um, I was six years old. We were clothes shopping. And I thought it was so cool that I wore a size six and I was six, and I thought that's how sizes went. And my mother and I picked out clothes, size six. I went in the dressing room. She came with me. She got very upset when the size six didn't fit. And she went off to find a size six X, um, very upset. And I didn't understand what was going on. But what I'm aware of now is that I was um, standing there in my underwear in the, in the uh, wardrobe changing area waiting for her to come back with more clothes knowing that she's angry and she's angry at me mm -hmm. and I don't know what for. Okay. She was angry, you didn't know what for and um, what's the movie title for that event? Uh, age 6, 6X. Okay. Age six, six X. And give me a number and location for that memory. It's um, more in the solar plexus region, and I'm guessing that's probably an eight. Okay. Let's work just on the age six, six X movie first and see how things go. So um, let's just tackle the title to start with. So even though I had this experience age 6, 6x. Even though I had this experience age 6, 6x. I totally and completely accept. I totally and completely accept. Eileen as she is today. Eileen as she is today. And Eileen as she was back then. And Eileen as she was back then. Even though I had that miserable experience. Even though I had that miserable experience. That miserable experience. That miserable experience. Age six, six X. Age six, six X. I totally and completely accept. I totally and completely accept. All versions of me. All versions of me. Five, six, six X, six X X. <laughs> Five, six, six X X. Me as I am now. Me as I am now. 
me as I was then. Me as I was then. All possible versions of me. All possible versions of me. In all possible sizes. In all possible sizes. I totally and completely accept all of them. I totally and completely accept all of them. Okay. Six H six six X. H six six X. Six six X. Six six X. Just call it six and six. Six and six. <laughs> six and six. Six and six. Six and six. Six and six. Is that enough of a reminder phrase to remind you of the event? Uh, uh six and six X. Six and six X, okay. The X was, yeah, the X oh, the X was, was big, okay. Mm -hmm. Just X, six and six X. Good. Six and six X. Six and six X. Six and six X. Hit a nine gamut technique, back of your hand, gamut point, close your eyes and open them. I start down to the left, six and six X. Six and six X. I start down to the right, six and six X. Six and six X. Eyes in a slow big circle all the way around. Six and six X. Six and six X. Good. Six and six, six X. And six X. Follow my finger. Six and six X. 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 Love and compete. Love accept myself. Love and accept myself. At every size. In every size. Every age. Every age. Every version. Every version. Every possible version of myself. Possible version of myself. Okay, take a breath. So tune back into your solar plexus now and see what number you are. And just again, maybe just tell the story again, tap, and then we'll get a new number. So tell the whole story again while tapping. Okay. And we'll do another, another um, assessment then. Got clothes shopping and my mother and I are looking for clothes and right. I remember the for some reason it was hard to reach up high enough to look at the shirts that we were looking at. So right. they're taller than me. they the the right. rods were larger. And I remember finding some things and taking them into the dressing room, and they were all size six. And I thought this was phenomenal to be perfect six at age six. And I'm trying them on, and I try the first one, and it doesn't fit. And I try the second one, and it doesn't fit. And I can see that my mom is getting really upset. And I don't understand what she's upset about. Let's just pause there in the movie, because you're having a good time at that point. You're having fun. And now mom's getting upset, so you know something's not quite right. Right. So how do you know mom's getting upset? Um, she's pulling down the clothes, and she's trying to get them to fit, and they don't fit. And the pulling down on your body. Yeah. Yeah. On the, uh -huh. the shirt to try to to try to see what's wrong, why it won't go on all the way, or whatever right. it is that's happening. It's not fitting right. Right. So she's pulling the clothes down on your body, trying to figure out why they aren't fitting right. Mm -hmm. Let's just stay with that for a moment. So, mom's pulling clothes down on my body. Mom's pulling clothes down on my body. Trying to figure out why they aren't fitting right. Trying to figure out why they aren't fitting right. I can tell she's getting upset. I can tell that she's getting upset. Don't know why she's getting upset. I 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 don't know why people get upset at me. I don't know why people get upset. I don't know why people are upset at me. Are upset at me. I'm Eileen. I'm Eileen. I'm a six-year-old. I'm a six-year-old. I'm delightful. <laughs> I am delightful. I am delightful, yeah. <laughs> it's baffling why anyone would ever be upset at me. <laughs> it is baffling, it is baffling. Why, why anyone would ever be upset at me. <laughs> yeah, and so you're just having a good time, and why people get upset is totally baffling. Yes. Yeah. But you can tell they are, even if you can't figure out why. Yes, I can tell. I can tell based on her face because I can mm -hmm. see. I can see the upset in her face, even though I don't know what it is. Exactly. Yeah. So mom's upset face. 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 Any other descriptive terms for her face besides upset? Um, you know, she's beautiful. 
she's really beautiful. So when she's upset or she's angry, it, it's really hard to tolerate. Mm. So she's normally beautiful, and so when she's upset, it's like it's jarring it's like, in some way. Or? Yeah, it's like the sun. The sun goes like eclipse. It's like a, the sun. Eclipse of the sun, yeah. right? <laughs> Mom's upset, eclipse of the sun. Mom's upset, eclipse of the sun. She's so beautiful normally. She's so beautiful normally. And she's upset. And she's upset. And, and I'm the cause of I'm it. I'm the cause of it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go ahead and catastrophize, generalize, broaden it. I'm the cause of <laughs> mom's upset. I'm the cause of mom's upset. I'm the only cause of mom's upset. I'm the only cause of mom's upset. I'm the cause of everyone's upset. I'm the cause of everyone's upset. If people are upset, it's all because of me. People are upset, it's all because of me. I'm the cause of everyone's upset. I'm the cause of everyone's upset. I am so powerful. I am so powerful. That if anyone's upset in the world. <laughs> anyone upset anywhere in the world. It must be my fault. <laughs> it must be my fault. <laughs> I am the great upsetter. <laughs> I am the great upsetter. <laughs> I always wanted to it was. Now I know. <laughs> I thought it was me. <laughs> Yeah, so that, that seemed that the laughter and the shift seemed to really kind of drain the, the energy from mom's eclipse. Yeah. Uh, what number are you now? Just think about mom's face, mom's uh, shift and mood. Oh, I'm not even a two, so it's somewhere between a one and a two. Okay, yeah, low number. Really okay. So let's just uh, keep telling the story to the very end, and we'll see then what you are on the whole story. So that, that happened. She went went to go and find other clothes. Oh, she's yeah. She's left the, she's left the um, fitting room, and the doors kind of bounced behind her. So she's got a lot of force going on, and I'm there in the fitting room in front of the mirror, and uh, you know, hanging out, hanging out, and partially robed, waiting for her to come back, mm -hmm. and not sure, not sure what's going to happen when she comes back. Thinking that I've done something to upset her, and so I'm kind of, I'm kind of. I guess, oh, interesting, I'm frozen, I'm waiting. Let's pause there. I don't know what'll happen when she gets back. I don't know what'll happen when she gets back. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. I don't know what'll happen when she gets back. I don't know what'll happen when she gets back. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Back of the hand, dying gamut, close your eyes and open them. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Eyes in a big circle. Don't know what'll happen when she gets back. I don't know what'll happen when she gets back. 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 What will happen when she gets back? What will happen when she gets back? I'm frozen. I'm frozen. I'm scared. I'm terrified. I'm terrified. I was happy a few minutes ago. I was happy a few minutes ago. I was perfect a few minutes ago. I was perfect ago. a few minutes ago. Everything was perfect. Everything was perfect. Now I'm terrified. I'm terrified. I don't know what will happen when she gets back. I don't know what will happen when she gets back. My best response is to freeze. My best response is to freeze. What can I do? What can I do? I'm half dressed. I'm half dressed. I don't know what's wrong. I don't know what's wrong. I don't know why she's upset. I don't know why she's upset. But I know that she is upset. I know that she is upset. I love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. Even though I'm responsible. Even though I'm responsible. For m mom's upset. For mom's upset. And other people's upset sometimes. And other people's upset sometimes. And my upset sometimes. And my upset sometimes. I love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. Even though I'm responsible. Even though I'm responsible. For people's upset. For people's upset. For mom's upset. For mom's upset. Let me take a breath. Just tap on terrified I, little Eileen. Terrified little Eileen. Ter she's in a, you know, because she's in a, it feels like she can't get away because she's in a, a booth. She can't get away, yeah, right? She's yeah, trapped. Yeah. She's stuck. Yeah. Trapped. Yeah. Even though she's trapped. Even though she's trapped. Love and accept her. Love and accept her. Love and accept me. Love and accept me. Love and accept me now. Love and accept me now. Love and accept her then. Love and accept her then. Accept all ver versions of myself. And all versions of myself. All versions of myself. All versions of myself. Okay, take a breath. And then what happened after that? She came back with more clothes. She came back with more clothes, and uh, that all seemed to go fine. 
down some stuff. I, I guess she must have calmed down because I, I my memory after that is that it went okay. And then we're trying on school clothes school coats and it's July and it's too hot to wear a coat. I don't want to take the coat off. She wants me to put the coats on and we're trying on coats and there's a little bit of a struggle there but it's not it's not related to right. the other. Right, right. So for that whole movie of H six six X, what's your triggering level of triggering right now if you tune back into your solar plexus? You know it, it there's there's no triggering about it now. Okay. Anything else you want to say to your mom or little Eileen uh, from your current perspective? Or just tap and talk to them and say, I wish you could have, I wish it had been. Oh, I, Mom, I, I wish you could realize that this isn't about anything that you did. Hmm. That I'm okay and I always will be okay. Good. <laughs> and tell little Eileen as well. You're phenomenally precious and always will be, and I will always be a part of me and always walk. Tap through all your points when you have that thought about her and think about her. Tell, tell her some more. She can use a bit more reassurance than that. Okay. Tell us how she really gets it deep in her core. Little Eileen, you are an amazing little beam of uh, God's light. Mm. You bring lots of joy to the world, lots of joy to me, and you always will. Mm. And sometimes when you don't understand what, what's happened, you can ask the big me and I'll, I'll take care of <laughs> How does she feel when you when she hears that? She just wants to go play. <laughs> That's a good response. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay, so one more breath. Hmm. We'll try to slow you down a bit because you you tend to move very fast, you know, talk very fast, your eyes move quickly. I can see when you're in your heart and your body you really shift down several gears and uh, you have uh, much more presence. So uh, being you know, present here, present for yourself, present for her is, uh, is really a, a good pace to, to do it at from a fast, fast pace. Some part of me wants to rip the band aid off. Right, yeah, yeah. So go back now to the time with your grandmother and the out through her clothes story. See what number that is when you tune into the story. She up her clothes, grandma, story, um, what number are you and where is in your body? Um, it's probably a seven and it's again back in the solar plexus. Okay. Actually, maybe an eight. Maybe an eight. Okay. So now I'm starting to get mad as I think about it. Okay, good. Get mad. Yeah. Uh, let's just start out by telling grandma how mad you are. Tap and tell her. <laughs> grandma, that was just a. It was mean. I think it isn't fair to use your superior intellect to try to shame me, which is what it felt like. I don't deserve to be shamed. I loved being with you and loved um, hearing your stories and being close to you, and this made me want to run away. I didn't like it at all. It was painful. It was shameful that somehow I have to be ashamed of who I am. Somehow I have, oh, somehow I have to be ashamed of how I am. Somehow who I am is shameful. Who I am is shameful. Yeah, okay. I gotta go through the points of that one. Who I am is shameful. Who I am is shame. I am shameful. I am ashamed of me. I have been shamed. Do yeah, the nine gamut around that. I'm carrying shame. Close your eyes and open them. I'm carrying shame. I am carrying shame. I am carrying shame. I'm carrying all the shame. I'm carrying all of the shame. Filled with shame. Filled with shame. Nothing but shame. Nothing but shame. Filled to the top with shame. Filled to the top with shame. All the shame. All of this shame. All the shame. All the shame. So much shame. So much shame. Too much shame. Sh too much shame. Too much shame. Too much shame. 
Don't deserve the shame. Don't deserve this shame. Don't deserve this much shame. Don't deserve this much shame. Don't deserve any shame. Don't deserve any shame. Don't deserve any shame at all. Don't deserve any shame at all. All the shame. All the shame. 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 Too much shame. Too much shame. Don't deserve the shame. Don't deserve this shame. Love and accept myself. Love and accept myself. With all the shame. With all the shame. Without all the shame. Without all the shame. Love and accept myself equally. Love and accept myself equally. With or without the shame. With or without the shame. Love and accept myself. Love and accept myself. Shame and all. Shame and all. All versions of Eileen. All versions of Eileen. Versions with shame. Versions with shame. Versions without shame. Versions without shame. Okay, just take a breath. I don't think you're done yet. I think there's something else in there. Any other memories popping up or any other feelings popping up that um, just rise to the surface? You know, I, I have a memory of uh, being in an abusive situation and being told that if I was fat, no one would ever love me. Mm. That's a good one. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm fat, no one will ever love me. If I'm imperfect in any way. If I'm imperfect in any way. If I'm imperfect in any way. No one will ever love me. No one will ever love me. If I don't meet others' expectations. If I don't meet others' expectations. No one will ever love me. No one will ever love me. If I don't meet my own expectations. If I don't meet my own expectations. No one will ever love me. No one will ever love me. Including me. Including me. <laughs> <laughs> especially me. <laughs> Most especially me. <laughs> Have to be perfect. Have to be perfect. Have to meet everyone's expectations. Have to meet everyone's expectations. Oh, a long list. Everyone's expectations. And only then can I be happy. And only then can I be happy. <laughs> <laughs> and not a moment before. <laughs> so, can't be happy. Can't be happy. Can't be happy. Can't be happy. 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 Fat. Fat. Thin. Thin. Happy. Happy. Unhappy. Unhappy. Fat. Fat. Thin. Thin. They're all just words. They're all just words. Oh, they're all just words. Love and accept myself. Love and accept myself. Just the way I am. Just the way I am. The mixed bag. The mixed bag. Like all human beings are. <laughs> like all human beings are. Love and accept myself. Love and accept myself. Okay, take a couple of breaths. Hmm. Now, I did get your side score before we did that last memory, but. Um, where were you and where you are, are you now in comparison? Um, it was a big chunk, not as big a chunk as I intellectually would have thought, so maybe like seven to three, something like that. Okay. There's something in there about how I look being more important than who I am. Okay. Let's affirm that then. How I look is more important than who I am. How I look is more important than who I am. Whatever I am doesn't matter, it's only how I look that counts. Whatever I am, it doesn't matter, it's only how I look that counts. I have all these accomplishments. I have all these accomplishments. Which stack up to nothing. Which stack up to nothing. Compared to how I look. Compared to how I look. Only how I look counts. Only how I look counts. None of the rest of it counts. None of the rest of it counts. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, then if that were the case, all you'd need is book covers, right? Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, gotta look perfect. Gotta look perfect. What's inside doesn't count. What's inside doesn't count. Nothing else, else counts. Nothing else counts. Only how you look. Only how you look. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Only how Eileen looks. Only how Eileen looks. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. I love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. Looking however I look. Looking however I look. I love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. Looking however I look. Looking however I look. Nine gamut, gamut point, close rise and open them. Eyes hung out of the left. Eyes hung out of the right. Eyes a big circle. How I look. How I look. How I look right now. How I look right now. How I've always looked. How I've always looked. How little Eileen looked. 
How little Eileen looked. How adult Eileen looks. How, a, how adult Eileen looks. How I look. How I look. That's what counts. That's what counts. That's uh, the only thing that counts. That's the only thing that counts. Okay, take a deep breath. Mm. Okay, so that sub-memory, <clears throat> that, that, that subset of these memories, that it's only how you look that counts. How do you feel about that now? Well, while I was... <laughs> While I was tapping, it was like this looks pretty. This looks pretty interesting. Um, so, being able to kind of make fun of it while I was going right. through it, kind yes. of um, brings it down to really nothing. Yeah. yeah, it does seem silly. You know, when you say it that way and tap, it's like that's ridiculous. Yeah, feel that. So let's work on an affirmative statement now. Just positive body image and positive self image. You know. So um, let's tap and say, I have a lot of gifts to bring to the world. I have a lot of gifts to bring to the world. I bring a lot of gifts to everyone around me. I bring a lot of gifts to everyone around me. However I look. However I look. Whatever I think of myself. Whatever I think of myself. What others, whatever others think of me. Whatever others think of me. Whatever grandma thinks of me. Whatever grandma thinks of me. Whatever my mother thinks of me. Whatever my mother thinks of me. I love and accept myself. I love and accept myself. I am lovable and yeah. acceptable. I am lovable and acceptable. I know I'm wonderful. I know I'm wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> and little Eileen's wonderful. And little Eileen's wonderful. I extend that feeling of love and appreciation throughout my lifeline. I extend that feeling of love and appreciation throughout my lifeline. Yeah, every version of Eileen is lovable. Every version of Eileen is lovable. Eileen in all her forms and all her ages is wonderful. Eileen in all her forms and all her ages is wonderful. And lovable. And lovable. Loving Eileen. Loving Eileen. Fully and completely. Fully and completely. The parts I do easily. The parts I do easily. Do easily. The parts I struggle with. The parts I struggle with. Love and accept them all. Love and accept them all. They're all part of Eileen. They're all part of Eileen. Love and accept myself. Love and accept myself. Okay. Take a breath. How's your body feeling now in terms of just your physical sensations? It's a lot more relaxed. Yeah. yeah. Now your eyes are different, your mm -hmm. movements are different. Um, just the way you're sitting seems more relaxed. So. Yeah, I feel much more centered. Yeah, yeah. This is such an interesting experience because I think um, sometimes I've had the belief that, um, to use an analogy of water and rock, it had to be a pressure kind of hose on a piece of rock. And in reality, that little stream going over the rock creates more change over time. Right. Yeah. Being gentle with yourself. Yeah, yeah. Being loving with yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much for doing this work. I so appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I felt very moved to witness your process. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Hmm.